Hello Leo, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So this is your reading for the next three months and this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. In this reading, Leo, we'll see what is your energy, what you need to know for the next three months. Uh, what is the energy of the person you're thinking about, you're dealing with, you will be dealing with. I would appreciate if you would hit like, share and subscribe and comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. There is an extended reading for this one. Link for the same is in description box and comment section. In the extended, we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, and likely conclusion between you and this person. Coming back to this reading on YouTube, I'm shuffling the cards. I'll lay them down, and then we'll see the energy between the the your energy for the next three months. Okay. All right, Leo. Eight of Wands. What is your energy for the next three months, Leo? I think so, Leo. Uh, you are manifesting speed to your life. You're like... There is a sense of feeling boredom, probably. Like, you're feeling bored. Like, why things are happening so slowly. And you will try to take things in your hand. You will be like, that's it. I really don't want... Uh, things to happen this slow in my life. Let me put in some additional energy. Let me dedicate and devote more time and more energy uh, towards this. Let me manifest whatever it is towards your life, towards the towards the ongoing work in your life, towards your love life, towards your health. Okay, you are trying to accelerate a lot of things in your life. Okay, and you are manifesting it. You are putting in some extra efforts towards uh, like you know uh, trying to bring things to that required speed okay say for example i'll just give you an example like you if you real if you wanted to go for weight loss or weight gain okay you're following the diet routine properly you're following the exercise routine properly but still you are not seeing the required results okay like despite putting in so much of efforts towards my diet towards my uh, towards my exercise why i'm not seeing the results okay so probably then you might think like okay i think so i need to change my dietitian or maybe i need to bring some additional changes to my lifestyle to my routine these are the things that i need to follow these are the things that i need to do xyz okay so you will try to put in some additional effort so you will try to bring certain required changes which will actually help you get that required speed uh, get the required speed and achieve the required goal at a greater speed so like i've cited the example about uh, about your weight gain or weight loss and after incorporating the changes maybe after changing your dietitian you're going to see some really good results okay when it comes to your love life, I also feel like you probably are, are becoming interested in someone. And I really don't see you hesitating and approaching that person. Okay, you'll be like, you're going to be very upfront. I also see that you're going to go out on dates quite a lot. Okay, like I, <laughs> for some of you, it might even be the case like you're dating one person one day. Okay. So next three months are like 90 days approximately. You you probably seem to be <laughs> this is this is this might be applicable for very few of you. Uh might even sound slightly exaggerated, but that's what I feel. Some of you might even go out on dates with 90 people, one date per day. Okay. So uh what I'm trying to say over here is you're trying to accelerate a lot of things and you're putting in some dedicated efforts to accelerate the things that you want to accelerate. Okay. Uh, also, you have some extraordinary energy and you have passion and you're going to put that passion and the energy, the additional energy that you are feeling 
you're going to put it to the right kind of usage okay so that is also why you're going to see the results coming towards you so it's like a complete go getter kind of energy you want this you're going to chase it you're going to make it happen you're going to put in the required efforts and you will see the results by the at the end okay so i also see that the next 3 months are pretty much result oriented you set your mind your eyes onto something you put efforts over there and you're going to see the results so this is very much result oriented the next 3 months are pretty much result oriented for you okay we have the judgment the judgment is also telling me that that there is okay i heard that for some of you some allegations were made against you okay and uh, it was a foul play done by someone and maybe some sort of verdict is coming and some sort of uh, pronouncement is happening which will help you free yourself from some negative reputation that came towards you okay now this can be like a lawsuit or probably a lawsuit you were dealing with a lawsuit related to defamation okay because of which your reputation got affected some some sort of wrong image was created but then that the lawsuit will go it will be pronounced in your favor the verdict will be pronounced in your favor and that's what i see that not only you are going to get a clean shit but i also see that you, it is also likely that you're going to win a good amount of money because of that okay so the apart from that i'm also getting that because of the fact that you are so action oriented you are so passionate and you are so full of energy for the next 3 months leo i also see that you're going to bring a lot of changes in your monetary situation okay there is tremendous amount of financial freedom that is coming towards you i also feel like i mean because it's a judgment card i sort of feel like the next 3 months are uh, life changing months for you okay the next 3 months are like probably if there was a curse that was running in your entire family that curse is getting lifted up in the next 3 months you not only you but also your family is freeing itself from some generational curse that's what i'm hearing and during the next 3 months okay you will also feel a lot more bliss uh, a lot more blessed by the end of like as you start nearing the end of 3 uh, months i do feel that oh, apologies electricity was slightly funny right now i had to pause the video so i was saying that around the end of 3 uh, months it is likely that you might feel slightly exhausted okay and that exhaustion might slightly pull you or make you slightly nostalgic well it might slightly pull you in the past that exhaustion might uh, i mean whenever um, you might find yourself thinking about uh, your excess or and not just one specific ex maybe if you had more than one ex then definitely all of them um, there will be certain memories which have been edged at the back of your mind you will be you you will you will try to remind yourself of those memories uh you might even find yourself drinking a bit uh nothing you're going to do that is going to harm you in any way okay or that is going to slow you down in any way uh but probably the sabbatical will be needed for you because your entire 3 months are looking so energetic and so full of work and so much uh, driven uh and determined to achieve the goals that you have so it's a sort of obvious that by the end of the 3 months you will feel slightly exhausted okay so this break the sabbatical from the work uh it it is slightly needed for you okay let's explore more we have queen of swords so queen of swords is telling me that uh you're finding someone leo and this person they i do feel like they will try to win your heart but they are not 
probably you will notice that they are not very good at uh, this you might see this person making some unsuccessful attempts to win your heart um, i mean not coming across as very smooth in their act okay so even though they might make some unsuccessful attempts and they will know that they are making unsuccessful attempts and because of that they might experience some frustration and they might even vent out that frustration onto you subtly uh, you will find this person's act a bit funny okay i mean you will you will find it adorable as well you will think like at least this person is making some efforts this person knows that they are not good at it this person knows that uh it's not their forte to uh, approach someone probably make a, a romantic pass at someone or probably try to flirt this person is not very good at it but at least they are making efforts even though they are making some unsuccessful efforts but you'll find it funny and you'll find it adorable and you're going to find it very sweet that's what i'm getting four of cups four of cups is also telling me that i think so uh, leo you might find resemblance with this between this new person that is coming towards you and one of your exes okay you might feel like oh my god is this a repetition of past okay like just because this person is looking like one of my exes does that mean that this person is uh, is just more or less like a uh, like my ex who was also toxic you might feel slightly uh, confused initially you might feel like should i give entertain this person more or should i stop it right away because i really don't want to experience uh, what i've experienced in the past i'm trying to move away from toxic people but i would suggest that don't jump on to conclusions try and know this person well beforehand before arriving at any kind of conclusion just because this new person and one of your ex is a look alike doesn't mean that their personalities are also same okay because you are stressing yourself out because you are uh you are emotionally letting this affect you i and i feel like this should not be the case okay you might feel slightly like oh my god did i make a wrong decision all over again no don't jump on to the conclusions because they are a look alike okay the they might be look alike but the personalities definitely will differ and by the way one of your soulmate was uh, so one of your exes was a soulmate but that soulmate was a karmic soulmate okay and the resemblance will be between this new person and that karmic soulmate okay the role of that karmic soulmate is over in your life they were meant to enter in your life they were meant to trigger you they were meant to trigger spiritual awakening in you rather okay then we have the empress the empress is telling me leo that whoever is is coming towards you they actually have the intentions to treat you in the best possible manner to give you the best that you desire and that you deserve okay this will be the treatment that will come from this person will be the most comforting treatment okay uh it will be the most respectful treatment that you have ever experienced not only respectful but this person will put you at lot of ease okay you i mean you won't fear uh getting judged you won't fear like oh is this person judging my actions my decisions or do i have to be careful and do i have to be conscious about whatever i'm saying whatever i'm doing okay maybe this consciousness was there in in your previous uh, decisions uh, in your previous uh, relationships okay you always had to think about your person first and then think about yourself and that is one of the reason you you kept on giving continuously to all of your excess and you, you did not get anything in return whereas when it comes to this person there is a lot that is coming towards you 
as compared to what you are giving back having said so doesn't mean that you are not you are not doing enough for your person but this person is a big giver there is a lot of satisfaction that is coming towards you so that is why i am saying that don't jump on to conclusions have patience give the situation some time all right i hope this resonates and hit like share and subscribe and comment down below link for the extended is in description box and comment section in the extended we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you what action they will take towards you and likely conclusion between you and this person all right Take care, have a great time and bye-bye Leo.